Hi, my name is Deborah Acker. I'm an intuitive coach and energy healer. And today I want to talk to you about a very common reason why you might be feeling anxious that you may not be aware of. And so I work, I tend to work with a lot of women, women that, um, many times have been left at some point in their life. Uh, many times this originates with a parent, whether that parent left them physically or maybe even that parent was working a lot and so they just weren't around or they weren't available. And one of the most common things that I see as I'm working and helping women to regain that sense of self, right, to feel secure and um, safe in their own body is anxiety, right? And I know as somebody who um, has recovered from the serious anxiety that I used to feel and the depression that I had experienced throughout um, my childhood and into my adult life, um, I felt it all the time and it kind of many times would overtake me. And so one of the most common reasons why we feel anxiety that we're not many times not attuned to tends to be us leaving our bodies. And so let me explain what I mean by that. Um, basically, if you think about, say for instance, I'll give, exa I'll give, I'll give several examples, but say for instance, you're out uh, on a date with somebody, right? And you really like them, you have a really good date. And when you get home, many times what happens, and we're not attuned to it because our physical body, it tends to be in, you know, in the space when we get home, right? But we leave a lot of our energy with that other person. And if you think of it, if your energy is with somebody else and yet your body's in a different space, you're going to feel like you don't have control, right? And that's going to cause anxiety. It's going to cause you feeling anxious. Um, another example I see is say, for instance, someone's criticized you or someone's made fun of you. I think we've all experienced that at some point in our life. If you ever believed them and you actually joined their side, that can be another way that you have left you. A third way can be around um, if you've let someone treat you in a way that's not respectful, right? In a way that that's mean. So obviously that could be criticizing, but it can also just be someone talking down to you or treating you in a disrespectful way or being mean to you. And again, if you believe them or you don't even take a stand for yourself, which again is very common, we get very conditioned to like not want to create conflict, not want to have issues. So if you've ever struggled with that and you didn't take a stand for yourself and say, you can't talk to me that way or that's not acceptable, again, that can be a way when you leave yourself. And when you do that, again, what tends to cause anxiety is because your energy, you're not in your body, you're not actually physically in your body. So again, it appears that we're in our physical bodies because that's, you know, how we're living life. But instead, your energy is still with that other person, right? Or you bought into what that other person said. So what can we do about this? I just want to give you a few simple tools to help you to really manage your energy and relieve the anxiety that can occur. So say, for instance, in the case of, you know, you're with a guy that you really like and, um, you know, you find yourself that your energy is still with him, right? So you're feeling anxious, like, is he going to call? What's going to happen? What you can do and what you can do when you're with him as well as when you leave him is to start to breathe in, to fill yourself up with you and to breathe in the energy of your own body, right? So it's just, it's just literally filling yourself up with you and just bringing your energy back into your body. As part of that, you can start to connect to yourself and ask yourself, what am I feeling right now? What's going on for me right now? What do I like about this person? What don't I like? Or what do I like about the situation? What don't I like? And just checking in with yourself, that's a big way that you can start to reconnect to self and really, again, bringing your energy back into your body. And just as an important side note, many times when we are left, when we're kids, that can cause a lot of um, anxiety because in the moment that we're left by a parent, subconsciously we also leave ourselves. And so that causes anxiety. But what also happens is we blame ourselves for that parent leaving. And again, whether they went off to work or they went literally and they left, you know, because your parents were getting divorced, whatever that looks like, Literally, you can still be experiencing, you know, you, st you still might be blaming yourself for them leaving, right? And when you blame yourself, many times that causes rumination, that causes obsessing, that causes overanalyzing. And we, we, we create that pattern to try to have control of something, something that we don't have control of, you know, with our parent leaving. So we go and we blame ourselves, we, st we start to ruminate, we start to obsess, and we take that pattern into every area of our life. 
And when we're kids, many times that's subconscious. But as we grow into adulthood, we all of a sudden, again, we're, we're obsessing, we're overanalyzing, we're ruminating, and that all literally stems from that first original moment. And one of the biggest things I help my clients with, because you do not have to live, I used to have um, that same pattern and I lived with it like every day my entire life, right? And you do not have to live that way. So that's one of the big things that I help my clients with, right? Is ruminating, obsessing, overanalyzing, and really having a strong sense of self so that no matter who's around you or who you spend time with, that you feel centered, you feel grounded, you feel calm, you feel peaceful, and that that's your truth, right? You're not forcing it or trying to, to force it. So... Thank you so much for watching. If you're wanting to go further with me, um, just mention that you saw this video. Right now I'm doing, it's a $99 um, session with me. So it's just a one-time special that I'm offering. So if you mention that you uh, see you saw this video and that you'd like to do that session, um, we can definitely go further. And you can email me at deb, D-E-B, at debra, D-E-B-O-R-A-H-A-C-K-E-R, Dot com. And also to check out, I have a bunch of workshops around the country. They're energy clearing workshops. So if you're interested again in taking this work further, again, you can just head to my website and uh, click on the workshops tab. But my website is just www.debrahdebrahacker.com. And I look forward to connecting with you soon. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.